<laughs> a little friend is actually laughing at me vlogging right now but it's so beautiful i've actually never been to somalia before but we came yesterday morning we did a little bit of traveling we saw our grandma we actually surprised her didn't expect us to come and it was so nice i literally recorded her reaction it was so funny but today we're taking it easy i don't really know what we're gonna get up to but that's part of the surprise that's part of the journey also girls i'm vlogging on a new camera it's like the little osmo pocket 3 and it's so cute and i feel like it's just gonna be perfect for traveling in so hopefully the footage comes out okay we're gonna have breakfast soon we're literally just sitting on the balcony at our uncle's house and yeah this is just part of the vibe this is what we're having for breakfast we're obviously having mala again and some nice somali coffee this is actually my favorite and we're just sitting on the balcony and enjoying the sunshine this morning <laughs> Hey girls, so it's technically day two in Somalia. Yesterday I didn't actually manage to get a lot of footage that I wanted to get done, mainly because we went to this restaurant. I think it's called Elite Hotels and it's a restaurant just by the pier. It's so nice because obviously you have like the water view at Lido Beach, but the only con I would say is they don't allow you to take in cameras, which I thought was very bizarre, but we went there with my cameras. I was ready to vlog everything for you guys, but they took my camera. They said, you're not allowed any cameras. But regardless of that, we went, we had some really nice food. I decided to go for some butter chicken and we had like these masala chips to share, which was super yummy. And my sister decided to get the chicken shawarma wrap. I think she said that was really nice too. But all in all, it was a really fun experience. I think I definitely want to go there again, but this time to actually see the sunset because we didn't get to see the sunset. We went around like 6 p.m. and that's just like, after sunset so it was a pitch black outside so to catch you guys up on today this morning me and my sister just went out with my mom we did we ran some errands with her she said it's gonna be like a really fun morning to be honest we literally just went to the office with her <laughs> and I was like mom this was not the outing you promised us but we're back home now we got all dressed up we're just waiting on our uncle and then I think we're gonna go have a look around Somalia again go to all the fun places maybe a cute restaurant a cafe as well and then after that we're just gonna see where the day takes us I think we're very open-minded I was just reflecting and thinking about like our experience in Somalia so far and alhamdulillah it's been really fun like when we came here I didn't actually come here with much expectations but it's been a great trip because I'm, I'm pretty sure I've already told you girls but I've actually never visited my home country before so it was about time I feel like 23 years too late but everything happens in divine timing I would just say if there's one thing that I was like surprised about is the amount of animals that you'll see on the streets like you'll literally see goats you'll literally see like camels you'll see all the animals it's like you don't even need to go to the zoo because the zoo is literally right here but yeah I feel like I'm excited for this evening see what we get up to keep an open mind and yeah I'm just having a good time so far so alhamdulillah Latte. Well, I'm having a chai latte and a carrot cake. This carrot cake is incredible. Amazing. My toffee nut yeah, latte is really good. <laughs> How's the toffee nut latte she loves? Where's the mic? My toffee nut latte is so good. <laughs> Turn that out, turn. Where's just, the mic clacking? It's right here, it's under my scarf. Hello. <laughs> We're just with our uncle and yeah, we had, we had some pizza before this. Yes, that pizza yeah. was amazing as well, mashallah. I would say like the waiting time in Somalia is really long, but the main thing is like they're making it fresh, so I feel like that makes up for it. Guys, you want to meet my uncle? This is my uncle. Hassan, you okay no, being here? That's Ryan, man. I'm here. I'm the baby. That's the baby. This is my little brother. Say hi. That's not brother. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Wow, he looks 
Oh, thank you so much. Yes. Sorry, nice I'm outfit. Too, I'm too shy. <laughs> Look at his nice outfit, Masha. So it's actually been a day since I last vlogged. Yesterday was pretty much a chill day. I spent it with my grandma and we just had a little girl one-to-one -one catch up with us and the rest of our family. Today was also a pretty chill day. We went to the hair salon and I also got some Elan done as well. Um, it's so nice going to the salons here in Somalia in comparison to London. Like we got our henna's done, we got our hair done and literally me, my sister and my mum and it all came down to £15. I'm like that is so unheard of because in London at least like getting my hair done is usually like 75 pounds but five pounds I'll take that and she did a pretty good job not that I can show you girls but right now we're just waiting on our uncle and we're probably going to go out for dinner get something to eat I feel like a lot of the nights here are pretty chill which I like you know you've got to take it easy sometimes <laughs> really honest with you right now it's actually been a couple of days since I last vlogged because I would say the main reason is like the lot of places that I've been to here like restaurants and all that kind of stuff they don't really allow cameras and every time I enter the store or anywhere like that they check your bags and they take your cameras so that is my reasoning but anyways today we actually have an exciting evening planned it's our last day here in Somalia and me and my sister are actually so sad because I feel like our time here went by so quickly we actually added probably four more days onto our trip because we were just having so much fun but yeah we added four more days and today's our last day and today we decided just to have like a big family dinner and I feel like it's going to be really big because we invited all of our like cousins our aunties our uncles so it's going to be a good old time and hopefully I'll be able to sneak my camera in somehow and vlog as well because I don't know I just want to update you girls just in general alhamdulillah I would say our experience here in Somalia has been so fun and oh, it's just been so grounding like I keep on saying to my sister like we keep on talking about it and saying like we feel more in touch with our like roots and like our traditions and all that good stuff because we've never been here before and it's our first time and it's just it's been an amazing experience it's been an amazing and beautiful experience alhamdulillah i agree that's half in the background but yeah so if you guys are like on the fence of coming to somalia and you're like i would love to visit but i'm not sure i would highly encourage it like even before we came i wasn't sure as to how like we will adapt to the culture and everything like that but alhamdulillah it's been an amazing time i feel like it's going to feel strange going back to the uk and like not speaking our own like traditional language but also i feel like our somali has really improved like it's like 100% like it's gone so much better like I used to be so scared to speak to other people that I didn't know that well in Somali like I used to speak in the most broken Somali and then now I'm doing great <laughs> Yeah, alhamdulillah, level up, level up. And it's so funny because I refer to like I used to and that used to, that past me was literally 10 days ago. But yeah, so that is the current update. Anything else I want to mention? Not right now, our flight is literally tomorrow morning. And yeah, alhamdulillah, it's been it's been an amazing time. So we initially did like a five day trip and then we ended up extending it to like a 10 day, nine day trip. And that is actually the perfect amount of time. Like we could easily spend a good two weeks here, but we did five days because we wasn't sure, about, <laughs> we wasn't sure as to how we would adapt into like the everything. So yeah, right now, I think I just want to get a photo, you know, get the priorities right, get a photo for Instagram and then we're going to head out for dinner. And I'm so excited. But yeah, I'll speak soon. Is hell no, 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 